Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Narendra here from Leo Tales and in today's video we'll be checking out how to apply contour blush and highlighter if you are a beginner even to create a daily makeup look. This is something that you can easily do but adds a lot of dimension and uh, a healthy look to your face as you can see you can make out the difference right so what we're going to use today is this contour d force palette by sugar it is in the shade vivid victory uh, so this contains three products it has a contour powder which is kind of good i think for fair to medium skin tones then a golden toned highlighter and finally a blush and it also comes with a mirror this is a very travel friendly packaging also something that i personally recommend to beginners this is perfect for your job so let's get started first i'm going to take this contour uh, brush I'll be putting some links in the description box you can check that out it's a very specific shaped brush so what we're gonna create is basically a three look on the face like writing a three on your face which will cover your forehead your cheek and your chin so I'm gonna take a little bit of contour powder onto the brush and I'll start with the cheeks from the middle of your ears up until the middle of your cheek maybe right below the eyeballs so this is how you do that so don't drag it till the opening of your mouth because that will create a very unnatural look as you can see now it looks like there's shadow on your face right which kind of gives a, a feeling that your face is a little smaller and also has some dimension to it so likewise you're going to apply on the forehead also if you are doing like full face makeup then the forehead thing will create a lot of difference but right now you can just do it so this is how you do for your forehead likewise you're going to do for your chin also if you have really chubby face then this will also give an illusion that your face is smaller and has a good structure to it so this is a very important step now you have to contour your nose also for that you can use a very small concealer brush or an eyeshadow shader brush take a little bit of contour powder now when you draw the line for your nose the two lines should be as close as possible because then your nose will look thinner also it should join to the eyebrows it should look like a single entity on both sides draw a straight line as i said they should be as close as possible so that your nose looks thinner because i personally have wider nose so contouring helps a lot for me and join it all the way to your eyebrows so it gives that perfect look for your face and now you have to blend it so basically when you blend it i'm using a bigger contour brush uh, don't blend it in the middle because there we are going to apply highlighter blend it onto both sides very gently very gently so that the harsh lines just fade out and you can see that your nose has some good shape to it see the contouring for your face and contouring for the nose create a lot of difference for your face especially if you have chubby face then you have to try and learn this technique Next, we're going to apply blush. For that, I'm using a blush brush, which is a very fluffy brush. Take a little bit of blush. Uh, just tap it onto the palette so that if there is any excess powder, you don't want those pigments to be deposited on your cheeks. It will look very unnatural. Now, we're not just going to put or apply the uh, blush onto your cheeks. Just smile so that you can see the apple of your cheek showing up. Don't just press it there. Instead, you just blend it gently backwards like this. See? Very much similar to the way you going to apply your uh, highlighter also you blend it backwards like this so that the brown tint that the contour gives on top of that the pinkish tint that your blush gives together it makes you it gives you that that healthy look that i was talking about in the beginning of the video see it gives a very natural glow to your face right also maybe because i'm wearing a pink dress it adds to the look but yeah this is how you do blush and i feel blush plus contour makes a lot of difference for your face if you're a beginner then this is something that you must be doing for your face now the star of the day is basically the highlighter if you ask me for that i'm using a fan brush just take a little bit of highlighter which is a golden toned highlighter that i'm using for my warm toned face see the way i'm holding the highlighter just about my uh, apple of the cheeks and just applying it and that's it boom it's like a blinding effect for your face especially when there is light you can see how reflective it is right see the difference on my left cheek no highlighter on my right cheek there is highlighter and it's glowing literally you can do that kind of you can apply it kind of all the way up to your eye line like that just a little upwards so that your cheek will look like you know it's pointing upwards which is kind of good and this is how the highlighter look i absolutely love how the entire highlighter blush bronze look makes my face look healthy you can also apply the highlighter uh, onto your nose underneath your eyebrows then below your chin etc you can also use a fluffy brush which is basically a, a fluffy brush for your eyes blending brush you can use that for applying highlighter but i prefer a fan brush because as a beginner a fan brush does a lot 
better job than this one so that's it i hope you guys enjoyed this video even if you're a beginner you can easily apply blush bronze and highlighter right now i hope you guys benefited let me know how you liked the video we will meet again until then take care bye